Take a look at stock ticker symbol RXMD right now, currently traded at 17.18. So before I jump into the daily, what I'd normally do here, uh, what we're going to be watching for, again, is going to be this bounce that we're seeing off this 30-day 30, uh, 30 simple moving average. So right now, we're taking a look at the 30-minute chart here. Each one of these candles represent 30 minutes instead of daily, which is uh, every candle is a day. That's what I normally always use for my charts. But as of right now, look at this big move over here, coming off that down to the 20-day simple moving average, right through that top of that upper boundary band back down to the 20 day simple moving average you guys got up to a major resistance level at that 1720 uh that is uh, obviously uh, playing a role right now in this one at that 1720 although you guys got up to that high today of 1755 i would assume with that break of 1720 18 is going to be your next level of resistance but you guys are knocking on that door this one could be setting up again getting that bounce off that 30 day simple moving average now if we jump over here to the daily again this looks uh, again this, we got to watch that we got to watch that break at that 17 1720. If not, it could begin to go sideways here or pull down possibly. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six consecutive green days here. Yesterday wasn't too sure. I mean, in all reality, you guys did end up opening up uh, yesterday. You guys opened up yesterday slightly below where you guys closed on the 5th, and that was going to be at 1618. Then you guys opened up at 1571. That's going to show a little bit of possible weakness. Not a lot, but a little bit. So obviously, you guys are opening up lower than where it closed the day before. I think it's going to be like a common sense thing. You would think that it would open up at the same, if not a little bit higher, uh, like it has been doing here all the way in the past. Okay. So basically, right now, watch it for that break at 1720. If you guys can't break through that, your levels of support going back down uh, are going to be around every penny like we said before the major one down here at 12 uh, 12 cents that's going to be a major support level that's going to actually tie up with the 10 uh, day simple moving average as well let's go ahead and get our notes in here 1714 resistance at 1720 support at 16 15 14, the big one at 12. All right, so again, I'm going to put it here. If you guys can't break, that 1720 might begin to pull back here some, in my personal opinion. Uh, your support level is basically every penny here going down, but the major ones I would watch for are going to be that 16, that 14, and that 12. Uh, again, I'm going to put, actually put that in here in the notes so you guys can see a better, clear idea of uh, what I'm seeing here, especially with the uh, moving up here to the higher levels. You're going to get uh, larger spreads as well. So if you guys are following the stock, RXMD, I encourage you to join Investors Hangout. Dot com. Check the link in the description below for the RXMD stock message board where you share your thoughts and your opinions with the tens of thousands of other active investors who use investorshangout.com daily.